So we're literally rushing there now to hopefully get there before the delivery man. And then that's it. We're completely 100% out of the house. There's something really annoying about my room. I'm lost. You think you've dented the wall? Are you joking? We didn't even bring the keys. Oh. Oh, check the other cupboard. What about this cupboard? Oh. <gasps> Check this one. <gasps> oh. Let's check this one. No. <gasps> this one. This one's got loads of stuff in it. What? Where? Jack, is it all gone? Google. <gasps> Google's gone. That's naughty. Dinner's gone. Dinner's gone. <laughs> That's because we're moving house today. Did you know that? We're moving into our new house. Yeah. You've got your stuff. Come on, I we need to go. Here. you got Millie. That cage is only for transport. She doesn't live in that pot. We get all them from Oh, yeah. Moments. Guys, this is just for transport. Millie has a huge mansion of a cage. I oh, hi, Millie. She, um, sweet you got your shoes coming um, in the day. Oh, yeah, that's what you said, isn't it? Yeah. Hey, guys. So today is moving day. Yay. Yay. Although me and Daddy are super tired because... Chloe was not a good girl last night going to bed, so we are very tired. So but tired. We are already, it was really relaxed this morning, very chilled. And then all of a sudden, the last half an hour, as it always is, I'm probably sure of everyone's big families, trying to get out the door is manic. And we had to be there for nine for the movers, as they've already packed up the van yesterday. But then I just got a call to say that Grace's bed is being delivered in 20 minutes. We were like, ah! So we're literally rushing there now to hopefully get there before the delivery man and then obviously our removal company. So yeah, exciting times. Gonna be helpful today, Case? Sure. In my room. I'm right. just gonna let you know right now, I'm not gonna be helpful. Yeah, you are gonna be helpful. Don't, do why are you acting minute. like a stroppy teenager? No, I'm just gonna, do, I'm like, just setting I'm just expectations. Mm. I'm setting expectations. Oh my gosh. No, but do you know something? Guys, one day soon, it might be a vlog of mum leaves dad v girls, if he carries on like this. Yay. Mummy. <laughs> Mummy. Is it awesome yeah. It's in the first van, it's all like my stuff. But then I ha they haven't packed up like my drawers and stuff. So when I get all my stuff, I can't really unpack it because I've got nothing to put it in. Yeah, and your bed. So. Yeah. But when the removal company came yesterday, because they're a company that help you pack everything up as well, like the day before, they literally spent the longest time in Casey's bedroom. Everywhere else, they were quite quick. Obviously, I had packed up a lot of stuff, but I told Casey to pack up most of her room, and hers was the longest. And I did, but. It took. It, the boxes run out, so I think I don't know. Okay, guys, so we will see you when we're at the new house. 12 seconds later. Okay, so <laughs> I'm back. Um, we are turning around because I just said to Joel, do you have the keys to the new house? Because they handed them to him yesterday, not me. So if they were handed to me, I would have them. But they were handed to this one, the one that says he's not going to do anything. Well, he's proven that already because... He didn't even bring the keys. I'm not used to carrying keys. The, the house that we live in at the moment has a keypad, like a code to get in. So I'm not used to having house keys on me. So it's like a new thing for me. Yeah, so, so now we're going back to the old house to pick up our keys to then go to the new house. Hopefully we don't Gosh, miss guys, Grace's What am I working with? with? Like, seriously, I feel like you must It's just gonna be one of those days, I'm telling you now. It's gonna be one of those days. I'm gonna go before I lose my... Okay, we're at the new house. I think this cupboard can be your like YouTube cupboard. My you YouTube can YouTube cupboard. in there. No, what I what, mean. As in, no, you as want in, me to as work in, in your there? lights. We can put shelves up and put all. Oh your, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because you need a lot of space, but not a lot of space. It takes a room. So. Like put lights and cameras, not actually work in there, right? Yeah. I thought you meant that could be like my office. Imagine. <laughs> put a little desk in there. You can come here. Go on then. Go on, bye. Go on, then, then. That's your house. Bye. Hello. All right, we'll make you like ready. Mind your finger. Mind your finger. We're gonna make you disappear. Ready? <gasps> she actually did disappear. Oh my lord! Well, that's one less kid to worry about. Can I bring your camera? You want to vlog? Here you go. Trust me, I'm moving today. Why? My nice clean floor. We'll just have to don't worry about it and clean it later. All right, here you go then. Here's the camera. Uh, um, can you bring my stuff in? Yeah. That stuff, please. This is a Sophie vlog now, is it? Yeah, it's all. The floor on the tail of the week. Where's my room? The book is 
don't even know which one's your room. Oh my this God. one's your room. Come on then. Are you vlogging? No! That's all bathroom! Can you get me a book of a sheet, please? Oh, that's... That's not your room. She doesn't know where her room is. Um, to be fair, I don't either. I think mean, it's this one. No, that's pretty, that's this pretty. one. This one's your room. And it's my room. She, she thinks she's broken. Where's my hallway? Where's my hallway? Your hallway's here. This is your hallway. Should I show you where your bathroom is? Yes. Your bathroom is in here. No, it's not. Yeah, it is. That's your bathroom. Oh, wow. They have a toilet. I've actually seen this bathroom, you know. <laughs> They come to my room. Go on, Chloe. Do the honors. Go on. No, I can do it. No! Oh, don't fight. Welcome to the room. Ta da! This is all Casey's bathroom. It is my bathroom, isn't it? Look at this. Open the drawer. What's in the drawer? <gasps> <gasps> Nothing. We've got a shower behind here. The under shower. Can I wash your hair? <laughs> Come on then. So basically we have like this little storage in here. Oh, it's this side. And it is huge. Like, when I tell you it's huge, I mean it goes, wait, Chloe, stay here. It goes all the way round, all the way down there, all the way round, all the way round. Yeah, yeah. And it ends up here. So it goes around this like whole bit. And it goes straight to there. And can I just say, if this was Gracie's bedroom, 100% she would have turned that into some secret den or a bowl in that, like, honestly, she would have done something crazy with it. But my mum's actually using it for storage, so I don't have that option to do anything with it. You go in the shower. Me go in the shower, go on and you film it. Um. This one. This one. You sure? <gasps> Guys, we are going to do a house tour. So I'm not going to show you all of the house, obviously. Guys, if you didn't watch the last video, it's the video where we actually got the keys to the house. So if you haven't, you should watch that one first and then watch this one. But what we said in that video is we're not going to do like an official house tour because we want to save that like it's exciting and I think you guys are excited to see it as well. So today you're going to see little bits and pieces of the house but mostly you're going to see us moving and kind of like filling up the house with our stuff and then the next video after this is going to be like our official house tour. But you will kind of get a sneak peek today of like different parts of the house. Where's my grace? Four, five, okay. Oh, what are you doing? Playing Six, seven. Grace's bed has arrived. No, we've got to get our own Wi-Fi. Oh. So I'm actually so buzzing for Grace because Grace's room is such a massive upgrade from her last room. Definitely. Like, it's more than twice the size of her last room. And My last room was literally like this. Yeah, literally, it was just like part of it. So, um, I don't know, I was saying in the car on the way here, I used to feel so bad because her room in our last house, like, just the way it was, it was quite small and it was quite dark and stuff, and now she has this big room, so. Oh, and they even came with some extra carpets. Oh, and it's your carpet for when she spills drinks all over hers. Fancy! The what? Fancy! The moving van. Yeah. What's here? The van. The van. Hello, guys. Oh, let's move this carpet out of the way. Hey. Move hey. this carpet out of the way. Yeah. Ah. Yes. Yes. Ah. Ah, hello, mate. The van is here. Sarah's giving me the job of putting together the bar stools. Huh? You think you've dented the wall? Are you joking? Are you actually joking? I don't know. Where? Even upstairs. Mum made me carry that this long box and I told her I couldn't do it. She said I could. And I fell into the wall. Show me. Where? Oh, I don't think that was you. I don't think it was. No, I think I did it more up there. Okay, so I'm going to put together the stools. Oh, I think there's been a mistake. And they've sent us pink ones. No, that is correct. Okay, so, because I can't unpack my room yet, I'm helping mum with the kitchen. You're welcome. You know it's not mum's kitchen, it's everyone's kitchen. You choose that it's oh, just okay. mum's kitchen, trust me. So I'm unpacking these new plates, and I unpack these plates and just put them in piles of like, which ones, so she put them away because she's them in a particular order. Well, 
going to a particular place. But I'm putting all the new plates in the dishwasher as well because they're a bit dirty. Not like dirty, obviously, because no one's used them, but you never know. Just got to clean them. Okay, so this is actually harder than it looks because I am so rubbish at doing this kind of stuff. I'm on page one. All I've done so far is get all the bits out. I don't think I like the toaster. You don't think you like the toaster? Yeah. Why don't you like the toaster? I think I, I, think I want it white. Yeah, oh my God, it, is, it does actually look awful. Don't know if anyone watching this actually has that toaster. I think in this kitchen it just stands out yeah, it's just way too much. Like white or black? Really. White, no, white. White with the silver would look nice. Guys, just like that, I became an absolute DIY god. Look at that. That's impressive, right? Well, has anyone sat? Wait, watch out, there's a spare bolt on the floor. Wait, wait, where's, why, there's never a spare bolt. Why is there a spare bolt? They just put an extra one in there. <laughs> Imagine the whole thing collapses. I wouldn't trust it. Oh. The guys have already unloaded the first van load, so we're gonna go back to the other house oh. and then fill it up all over you again. Are. Yeah. Oh, I'm going. Oh, I'm going on my own. Yes. Oh, I'm gonna go and do all the hard work. Okay, so I'm back at the house, and the first thing I'm gonna do, obviously very important, I'm gonna make sure I order all of us some breakfast. So I've got some egg and bacon sandwiches turned up and some coffee. Joel has obviously gone to um, help. I say help, we all know he's not going to help. He's probably sat on the sofa, doing nothing. So I'm sure you guys are wondering what we are gonna be doing with this sofa here. Because this sofa is iconic to our channel. It's like another character in our DVG fam. So this sofa is actually gonna come with us. But what we're gonna do is we're gonna remove one of the pieces from it so that it fits in one of the rooms. Cause at the moment it's too big to fit in the room we want it to go in. So if we get rid of like, say this piece here, then it will fit. Cause we love this sofa. It's so big and comfy. We've got two new sofas that are gonna be turning up for like, we've got like a lounge. Is that what you call it? Like a lounge, like a, kind of formal sitting room. I hate that term. It's not a formal sitting room. It's just like, it's not a TV room. It's more like a socializing room. And then we've got like a TV room, which is where this sofa is going. Cause this sofa is like, it's for watching TV really. It's so weird this house being so quiet. Like it's so quiet and it feels so empty. It's like a really strange feeling. I should probably get up cause I'm gonna fall asleep otherwise. What do you think dad's doing? I think he'll help. You think he will help? Yeah. You know he hasn't helped yet. He put a chair up. He put one chair up. Yeah, but it, it's, it's different when you're there because you put stuff in. Here, it's just for him because he takes stuff out and doesn't know where it's going. You guys, you saw evidence that I did actually try to help. But every time I try and help, I feel like I'm just getting in the way because I'm like passing boxes that they didn't want yet. They have a certain way they stacked the van. It's not an excuse. I um, am in the kitchen. I'm just trying to get everything unpacked, but it's actually really hard to unpack stuff into the kitchen of like, until you've used your kitchen, you don't know where you want things. And what I've just realized is the last two houses that I've moved in, we've always had help from like my mum and she's always unpacked my kitchens both times so now i've got to do it myself one but two i don't really know where to go and i feel like i can't have my mum to help me because obviously the whole yeah, covid in case you just touched my mic obviously the whole covid stuff we're not allowed obviously we're allowed the company to help but we're not allowed our um family so my mum can't help so mum if my kitchen sucks when you come around and you have a look at where everything is it's your fault, to be fair, because you weren't here. Um, so yeah, but I just wanted to show you. I got some new slippers. I got myself some new slippers for the new house. Which is really boring for you guys, but really exciting for me. Guys, it's just so strange. Seeing every room so empty. Oh my lord, I've never seen this wardrobe so empty, look. So guys, this was always like the best hiding space when we were hiding. But you had to get through like all of these clothes first to get there. But yeah, that was the best hiding space. Sophie, obviously, as you guys know, has a new bed coming. I don't know if we got a new bed for Coco or she's taking that one. Where's my help gone? 
Oh, well, what else is this? Yeah, sure. Get 4G. And then... And... I'll start my messages because I'm popular. Great, thanks for your help. You're welcome. So, I'm currently, like, doing my room. So far, I've done my wardrobe. I've put up a chest of drawers, which I need to sort out. Hidden chocolates. <laughs> I've got my bed up with two bedside tables either side of it. And my chair with my desk. I have a lot more stuff to do, so I need to get started on that. So the guys have just got another van loaded up and we're gonna head back to the new house. I think I've got one more van load to do back here, so I'm gonna go. Hopefully Sarah doesn't ask me what I've been up to, because, you know, I don't wanna lie to her. But I also don't wanna tell the truth. So now I am sorting mine and Joel's clothes and there's so much, but Joel will be happy because I've worked it, all his stuff out. So jumpers, t-shirts, and then shirts, his coats, his trousers, and then when the other bits come, put in there. So I've organized it all nicely for him. No excuses, Joel, for it to be on the floor anymore, okay? I'm lost. I actually got lost on the way to our new house. So, and I don't have my phone on me. So Sarah's probably wondering where I am. She's probably thinking that I'm just using this time to be lazy. I wish I was. I'm actually just genuinely lost. Look at these. These were the dresses. There's two there. These are the dresses that so uh, Casey, sorry, Casey and Grace wore on our wedding day. So we had them made so it matched the exact colour of my dress. They were just like me. So cute. Oh, I got lost. Our dining table has arrived. Has it? Yes. I That's good. Oh my god, I've been so busy. You've been busy? Yes. Same. Oh my god, so our dining table has arrived and the guys put it up as well, which saves me a job. And our sideboard, which is incredible. So this is a matching sideboard to the dining table. So it's so good. Hold on. Let's have a look. Oh, they put your bed up. This bed is so cool because it's kind of like you can sit up like a sofa or you can lay down. Or you can lay down. I do have actual pillows by the way. But that means if you want to sit up in your bed and then like watch TV, we could put I've like a, a TV there or something. You. you got a surprise for me. Yeah. So much is happening since I've been gone. Joel Conda. You have to, you have to do it from down here. <gasps> You've so you got, got all, your, my clothes. all your coats are there, yeah. your jumpers, your shirts that you probably wear. Then your t-shirts. All my black stuff. And then, and then a few white and grey bits. Your jeans and your tracksuits. And then it's going to be your hats. Oh my god, I've got a whole drawer just for my hats. That makes and me then, happy. Yeah, so. Awesome. So yeah, he's coming to you. So where's your wardrobe? Um, well, mine doesn't really fit. I have to try and work out what I've got to do. But so far I've got this bit. So I'm going to put my shoes in there. Like my high heels. And then I've got awesome. this section. She's got all of it. Oh, I think we'll save the rest of it for the house tour because we're showing too much. There's something really annoying about my room. I've got these massive windows which are really good and more over there. But I have no blinds or curtains or anything. So there's going to be a struggle because I'm going to wake up at like, what time does the sunlight come out? Like five? I don't know. I wake up at five in the morning, you know, I don't want that. <laughs> and also, with my desk that I've just done here, I actually realised that Millie needs to go on this one because I have loads of different ideas for my whole room. So Millie can go on this one and then I might get a big desk over there with a mirror. But we're going to do up my room really nice so then I can have a really nice room because my last room was quite small and like stuffy with no windows. So I'll have a nice, really big room. So I have just done Sophie's room, so I'm out of breath. And it is so beautiful. Like, it's so nice, she's got the nicest bed. I actually can't wait to show you, but I'm not gonna show you now because I wanna show you her reaction because I've kept her from coming up in the bedroom. So I'm gonna show her and then I'll show you guys. So just when I thought this day couldn't get any more exciting, then this just happened to me. They now do the eggnog latte at Starbucks. They only do this for Christmas time. And this is my first one this year, so this day is just getting better and better. Okay, so I've been doing the kitchen and just helping my mum because like, obviously I know what stuff goes in like a kitchen and like what, what to put where. So I've been doing that, so I haven't had time to my own room and I've really just come up and actually seen my room and how much stuff I have. Like, look at this, okay. I mean, this one has to go in the storage and so does that box, but that's literally it. So I've been like, 
kind of put in my bed together because it's really easy. Like, it's just like clips. Really easy, like, I they're like two boxes because obviously it's drawer ones. So it's two boxes and then that just literally just slots in. So I don't need any screws or anything. So that's why it's easy. But I need to like get my drawers in place. I'm actually getting like a wardrobe built like, across this whole thing. So I had to keep my chest of drawers until I get that built. I'm heading back to the house. There is one more van load of our stuff and then that's it. We are completely 100% out of the house and everything will be in the new house. So in my bathroom I put a scented soap, lavender and this for your rings so then when you wash your hands you can take your rings off and then in here i've got all of this stuff like spa stuff over here face mask bath bombs body bars um, hair wash stuff lip balms and like feet and hand masks and stuff like that and then in the next one i've got my candles and then just stuff on my toothbrush if we look over here then i've just got Three candles lined up. The last van load has just left and that's it. All of our stuff is officially out of this house and it's looking very bare. This is such a strange feeling. It's like obviously it's very happy like we're so excited to be moving but there's so many memories here that it also feels a little bit sad that we're leaving. But it's a new chapter for us and that's obviously always a good thing. So yeah, look, this is our living room. There's literally so many memories, so many videos that I can think of that we did here. <laughs> Casey's jiggling. <laughs> Think ah! Think And of course, mine is Sarah's bedroom. Right. Normally, you just go. <gasps> it's my phone. I've just realised. Don't drop that phone. It's brand new. For the size of this chandelier. Ah, oh, forgot my kite. Oops. Sorry guys, I literally ruined that montage. Let's try that again. Sophie's room is done and she hasn't seen it yet and she is going to freak out when she sees her new room. So we've kept her downstairs and she's like literally going mad to come and see it. So we're going to let her come see it. And Coco's room is done, so we're going to let her see her room as well. She hasn't seen it yet. It looks amazing. You okay? She said, like, here's my toys, here's my stuff. <gasps> Where's my bed? <laughs> this is not your bedroom. This is your playroom. Did you go up and see him? Yeah. Where so I, I have seen her room. She, she's, you've seen both of them? I've seen both of them, yeah. You guys want to see your bedrooms? Yes! Come on then. Okay. Coco's room. <laughs> Mummy's done okay, your room. Okay, Coco, your room nice. first. Okay, ready? Go on then. then. Do you love it? I love it like this, Ma. It's yours, isn't it? Oh. You've got a little chill out area. Oh, I But when you're having a tantrum, you can just chill out in here. <laughs> you can take your books and read your books and that's your reading corner. That's not there. That's your wardrobe. That's your wardrobe. Oh my gosh. All your clothes. <laughs> oh my gosh. And your bed. Oh my gosh. Do so you love it? There's nothing. Rubbish, okay, yeah. hold on. Yeah. You ready? Yes. Wow! My bed! <gasps> my bed! Whoa! My bed! Baby. Yes! This is your bedroom! My dress it up! My dress is, yeah. Okay, so like, this is mine. I've got a 
I've got a bit of clothes in there. Still. What do you think of your new bed? I like my bed. Do you love it? I like my box. This is your own big bell bed. It's massive. So you sleep in it all night. Thank you, Mama. I. The thing is, every time I do a box, it just feels like there's 10 more being put. So it's like there's stuff, there's progress, but it's hard. Like in the bathroom. So I got this sign that Ava got me in and like a little candle and then like my little crystal there because look how good that matches. Yeah, and then in the drawer I got like my skincare, which I need to go through and throw some stuff in the way. Throw stuff in the And then I'm gonna get like drawers there, or, like drawers there for like my razors, bath stuff, like toilet roll, like just like the necess necessary, the necessary stuff, yeah. And then I've like, just put my drawer there and that's all of them and then i've got like up here is like loads of stuff that needs to go on my desk but i haven't bought one yet um and then i've done all my alex drawers like normal and then this is like all my bedding that i'm gonna do honestly it's just i'm like because loads of it's closed which i'm getting a wardrobe and i don't have space for it so i'm waiting for that like all these boxes wardrobe 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 like all closed and then because we have like a little attic here is I put one of my drawers and I can put stuff in there that I don't really like use like on a daily basis but like just to save some room but I'm just gonna carry on and then see how far I get. I'm excited about your room? I can't. Are you so tired? I can't. What? What's the matter? I can't go in my room because I have to do my dressing up. Do, 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 do. I'm gonna finish it tomorrow. We've done lots today. No one in my shoes my hair. Here. Your high heels are there and you're dressing up. Mom, please, Mom. Oh, baby. Because I want to get dressing up and all of these stuff. So Sophie um, loves her room. She's got to the point where she's telling everyone they have to leave her room and she's just in here by herself. So she's getting a little bit overwhelmed. She wants to kind of get everything out, all her books, all her dressing up. Um, but it is bedtime now, so we need to put Sophie to bed and Chloe to bed so that Mummy can start on downstairs. Wait, no, please, Mum. I want to dress this dressing up. Okay. Today. Yeah, you can do that. Yay! Can you say goodnight, Stevie G fam? Good night, Stevie G fam. I have a nice day of sleeping. You've had a nice day. Oh, <laughs> so cute.